Hey everybody, this is Luke. Um, today I'm just going to show you a quick way, a quick alternative for tortilla chips for dipping. Um, what I've done is I've whipped up a batch of bean dip uh, from one of our other recipes. And tonight, instead of putting it on a wrap, I'm actually going to be having it um, with some tortilla chips. Now these are really quick and easy. Um, we're using the same kind of whole wheat tortillas that we use for the healthy pizza, the quesadilla, the healthy wraps. So we're reusing our ingredients, which is really cool because you'll have it on hand and you know if you can make four or five recipes out of it. it helps you save money at the grocery store and everything. So what we're going to need for these chips, first of all, turn your oven up to, see what I put it on here, 400. Let that preheat. And I'm going to go with two tortillas. Now mine are, what kind are these here? Don Poncho. Now these are a high fiber, low carb, whole wheat wrap. Um, 70 calories in one of them, 2 grams of fat, and 5 grams of protein. 100% whole wheat. So what you're going to do is you're going to take some olive oil and just pour a little bit into a small cup. Now what I do is I take a little paper towel. If you have like a brush, um, you can use a brush to brush it on, but we're just going to put a thin layer right on top of these tortillas. So I just get my I get my uh, paper towel covered in some oil, and I just just brush it on. Just helps them brown up a little bit in the oven. And it also helps our salt stick to it. So brush on this oil. Now I maybe put in a teaspoon, and I'm not even using it all. Plus, a lot of it soaks into the soaks into the paper towel. So I got my olive oil on there. I'm just going to take regular table salt. If you have like sea salt or something like that, go ahead and use it. So I just sprinkle just a little bit on. Okay, and you can cut them into into like triangles and chips. But what I do is I just I find it easier if I just cut them into strips. So I just take my pizza cutter and I just start going to town on these. You know, about an inch. Doesn't matter, you're just going to dip them anyway. And I just cut it in half. Okay, so, and then just put them on a, just a regular cookie sheet. So you can see they're about, you know, this big here. Put the oil side up. Alright, now we're going to cut our other one. Just cut it into strips. Half once. It's arbitrary. And, you know, this is um, this will replace your tortilla chips. A lot of times when people snack and people eat, it's either out of habit, or you know they like the crunch, or they like the texture, or they like you know just sitting in front of the TV and eating something. The little bit of salt that we put on top of these, and the crunch that we're going to get from baking them in the oven, and the bean dip with the, the acidity from the um, from the lemon juice and everything. It's really going to satisfy a lot of those cravings that you have, and we're going to do it in a healthy way. Okay, so we spread all these out, and now my oven's preheated to 400. I'm just going to pop these in. Um, depending on where you're cooking it, what kind of wrap you have, you're going to want to set your timer to about three or four minutes and then check on them. If they start getting brown on top, you're going to flip them all with some tongs. I'll put that in there, set my timer. I'm going to just go three minutes. Now for the stats on these, um, the healthy bean dip, if you eat the whole thing, which is a pretty good serving, is going to have 120 calories, um, virtually no grams of fat. And then in the wrap, like I said, we're going to have two wraps I did, so 140 calories. Um, fat is going to be 2 grams each, so it's going to be 4 grams of fat, 10 grams of protein. So you're looking at, see, 120 plus 140. 260 calories, about 15 to 16 grams of protein, and 4 grams of fat, and you're going to satisfy your, your chip and dip craving for a late night snack or watching some TV or whatnot. So we're going to let these cook. Uh, we'll come back and check on them when they're done, show you what the finished product looks like. So stay tuned. All right, so we're back. Um, that was about 8 minutes in the oven, and I had to keep track of it because some of the little order pieces crisped up 
a little quicker than the big ones. So I just pulled those out so they wouldn't burn. Um, so I pull my chips out, nice and golden brown, and crispy. Just put these in a bowl. And then I'm going to show you the finished product, what it should look like when you get yours done. So again, we got two wraps on our bean dip. It's going to be a nice big bowl full of chips and a pretty substantial amount of bean dip. And like I said, again, 260 calories, 4 grams of fat, and 17 grams of protein. We have our crispy, crunchy, salty fix right here. We have our dip with our acidity fix. You know, pair this with a big glass of water. Or, if you're into diet soda, go ahead and have half a diet soda or something like that. No calories. But again, nice, easy, simple, healthy way. We're reusing ingredients. And it's an alternative for, you know, what is really normally an unhealthy snack. So, give it a shot. Hope you like it.